All right, y'all, welcome back to Rooster Crow TV, man. It's been a minute, but we back. Yo, check this out, man. This one is really, really disturbing. Coming straight out of Wisconsin, man. Really disturbing. Let's get into it. It's about a 16-year-old dad who killed his own daughter shortly after she was born. Disturbing, disturbing. On January 5th, 2021, whomever the ancient mother is gave birth to a baby at home in the bathtub. Shortly after the birth of the child, the couple decided that they didn't want to keep the child. So they discussed several options to get rid of the child, including dropping her off at a fire station, a police station, or even an adoption agency. Apparently adoption wasn't fast enough. So they decided that Logan, the father of the child, was going to drop the child off somewhere. It took the ancient mother's father several days to notice that his granddaughter was missing before calling the police. But by that time, it was too late. According to the girlfriend, Anderson, the father of the child, was supposed to take the child to a nearby adoption agency but it seems like Logan had plans of his own. While still at the mother's house, Logan put the infant in a book bag and the mother didn't help him at all. After he left the child's mother house, he went to his mother's house and transferred the child into a bigger book bag. As he left the house, he could hear the baby crying. So he jumped up and down in order to swoove the baby. He went to a remote location and placed Harper, the baby, who didn't have any clothes on, into a small area in a fallen tree in the freezing Wisconsin weather. Anderson allegedly told police that the baby started crying. So he covered her up. So he covered her up with snow before walking away. But he forgot to mention the part that when he was walking away, before he could cover her up with snow, he put two slugs in the head of his own daughter. A teenage boy in Greene County is charged with killing his daughter just days after she was born. The DA is charging 16-year-old Logan Kruckenberg Anderson as an adult, facing first-degree intentional homicide and hiding a corpse. Our Jamie Perez shares more about what we found out through the criminal complaint. Obviously, this is the worst uh, that it gets, a first-degree intentional uh, homicide. That's one reason a Greene County judge decided to hold 16-year-old Logan Kruckenberg Anderson on a million-dollar cash bond today. It's a charge the teenager faces just one week after his child's birth. The evidence in this case, I would say, is extremely strong. According to court documents, Kruckenberg Anderson told police he talked with the baby's mother, and they decided they could not keep the child after she was born January 5th in a bathtub. Kruckenberg Anderson took off with the baby. Family reported the baby missing January 9th. Kruckenberg Anderson originally told the sheriff's deputy he gave the baby to a friend to drop off at an adoption center. He couldn't provide police with the friend's last name, phone number, or address. The State Department of Justice and the FBI sat down with him on Sunday. That's when he admitted to taking the baby into the woods, covering it with snow, and shooting it twice in the head. The violent nature of the acts is another potential consideration. Crime scene investigators found that what he said was true. Judge, we have here a... 16 year old who has made numerous very poor choices already um, who is facing life in prison um, the evidence is extremely strong and i think there is an extremely high likelihood uh, that he would flee a defense attorney asked for a five hundred thousand dollar cash bail but the judge agreed with prosecutors setting the seven figure bond for the state's number one felony jamie perez fox 47 news at nine his preliminary hearing is set for next Wednesday at 10.30 a.m. He faces life in prison if convicted. With all that crazy stuff being said, this kid, Anderson, and his attorneys, 
they're back in court trying to get his case moved over to a juvenile court because he was charged as an adult for pumping two slugs into the back of his own daughter head. If this guy go to juvenile court, he can end up doing seven years on a Y.O. plea, you know, if it works that way in Wisconsin. But going to juvenile court for the kind of crime that he just committed is a big no-no. I think this is a case that more people need to pay attention to. There's something going on in Wisconsin. Let's not forget the good Christian community got together and they bonded somebody who murdered a few people on camera in uh, Kenosha, Wisconsin, Rittenhouse. He's out, he's at home, living his best life. Something going on in Wisconsin, but um, as more information breaking about this story, because they're trying to keep it under wraps, to be honest with you, you know? It took it took a while for like a little bit of information to come out, but it wasn't too much of it, you know. But as more information come out, man, I'm gonna be sure to break it to y'all, man. Till next time, let's talk about it in the comment section, y'all. Yeah.